Hi everybody. Today is Monday, June 20th, 2022. Welcome all my yarny friends, new and returning. Today's video as promised is for my one year potiversary. So welcome to Jonna's crochet journey. One year, holy smokes. All right, I wanted to do this um, a little bit different for this um, celebration of my potiversary. I am going to start this today, June 20th, 2022, and it will end July 1st, 2022 at 7 p.m. And then I'm not sure if after that or the following day, I will be drawing to see who wins. So I am going to do three winners, three different gifts. And I'm gonna show you what I have. And then I am going to let you know what you need to say down in the comments below. Um, <clears throat> I will have the rules down, but everybody knows pretty much what the rules are. Um, you have to be 18 or older. And I think since it is for um, a potiversary, that I'm going to make it worldwide. So that way I can let all of my Yarny peeps know how much I appreciate you coming back and watching my videos and liking and commenting and having interaction. I have no idea what shipping costs if you're out of the US, but I'm just gonna do it. Cause again, I enjoy everyone supporting me. My cat is scratching at the door. <laughs> um, so yeah, 18 or older, it can be worldwide. Um, what else? The cat is sidetracking me. <laughs> um, it's not affiliated with YouTube or anybody else. It's all me purchased by me. Um, I don't want to mess up my microphone, but... Ooh. I'm going to use the YouTube random comment picker. Doo, doo, doo. You must be a public subscriber to my channel because I will check. Void where prohibited. If you cannot receive things into your country, period, or um, you know, if you can't pay the taxes if you have to pay taxes into your country, then please don't put in and waste my time and yours and money to ship anyways, um, because that's just wrong to do that. I mean, I know it's fun to enter. I love entering them myself, but I also would never enter if I could not afford to pay taxes and duty fees if I was to win. That's just consideration for a fellow crafty person. I think that's it. If I forgot something, a lot of us have done this enough to where we know the rules, but I will also type them in the description box. Okay. I'm going to show you what I'm putting in first and then I'll tell you what you have to say. 
So the first drawing will be for some wool. And I wanted to keep this separate just in case people are allergic. I get scratchy and I'm like, is this wool? Ugh. Yeah. So, okay. I have, first of all, ice yarns. And I will read from the one I have. Anyone who has gotten from ice yarns before knows that there is no name and I do not have the packaging. But this says wool melange, 30% wool, 70% acrylic, 180 meters. It's a medium four and made in Turkey. And that's really all it says. So there's two of those. I love these colors. I don't know if you could really see, but it's just scratchy and I just don't deal with wool. So as I was cleaning through, I've I want to give this to somebody who's going to be able to use it. The second one I have is Buttercream Luxe Craft Roving. And I'll hold that up while I read. 115 yards, 105 meters. It's a five bulky. Says to use a six millimeter crochet hook and a six millimeter knitting needle. The colorway is orchid also made in Turkey and this is a hundred percent wool and there are two of those. I think the ice yarns is a four so I'm not sure if you could put those together. And the last one for the wool last year when my husband went shopping for me at 2021's Hobby Lobby clearance he picked up four of these so I have four and it's I love this wool um, super soft naturals pure and simple and this is originally was $6.49 and he got it for me for $1.62 and again I just can't do it I know he tried and I appreciated it but I just can't work with it this is made in China and the color is brindle. So there are four of those. It's brown and white. So that's the first um, prize. The second prize, and I ordered these pink bags. So this is what it will come in, hopefully, unless I get um, to the post office and if someone is, you know, in a worldwide um, and they, the lady says, hey, this is cheaper to go this way, then I'll switch it out. But so far, that's the plan. The second piece of the giveaway will be this Burnett Baby Blanket Tiny. This is tested for harmful substances. It's 316 yards, 100% polyester for medium and this color is spring lamb and you will get two of these now it says a four medium but that to me 
is like a two. So it's just hard for me to work with. And this is really, really soft. Definitely the opposite end of the wool. Wish I could work with it, but I, I just can't. And there are different patterns on the labels. You will also get two of the same yarn, but in the color Brown Bear. And then this is in the bag, so I'm going to leave it. Two in the color Clear Sky, which is almost like a greenish blue type. Hard to see. So the second one will be ugh, six of these. I just can't hold it all. Okay. So that's winner number two. The third prize, gift, whatever you want to call it, is going to be hooks. And I ha have this tiny little thing of stitch markers. Different colors. They're just like, you know, real tiny. I don't know if they say you should use these more for one project than another, whether or knitting, crochet, but they're really tiny. And they have the little hooksies. I've had these since I started crocheting and I've never used them. I go to the ones that look like little diaper clippy ones. So they'll be these. And two, four, six, eight, nine hooks. And um, <laughs> let me find. So it looks like this is a four. I showed these in a previous purchase. These are from Hobby Lobby and they're the Yarnology Luxury Crochet Hooks. So you have a four millimeter, five millimeter, mm, 5.5, Then there's a six, which is a purple, six and a half, seven, eight, a twelve. and a 15 and these are all one piece i have not crocheted with mine yet i got two sets one for me and one to give away so again this will be the third prize all right so what you have to say is three things if you so choose in your comment and hopefully it's a nice comment and you know whatever um if you're interested in the wool use the word wool if you're interested in this burnett baby blanket yarn winnings use the word baby if you're interested in the hooks use the word hook or hooks um 
hooks with an S because I don't want when you put in the specific word to throw anybody off and not include someone. If you're interested in all three, make sure you use the words wool, hooks, and baby. Okay. Um, the other thing is I will not in the comments comment to anyone. I will heart your comment to show that I saw it, but I won't comment. I will not say, hey, you're the winner, contact me. It's not going to happen. I will put up a separate video. I, um, would hope that no one please use the word giveaway so that maybe those weirdos out there won't be attracted to the video either leaving rude comments or saying that you won. I will also type that down just to remind everybody because giveaways are kind of losing their funness because of these people. And I don't want to do that because I am happy and excited that I've made it a year already and I've met so many awesome people that for the ride of the year and for years to come, I decided to do the three prizes. And I will end this on July 1st because even though I'm not participating in Christmas in July, I still plan on giving some stuff away in July. So I want to end this like July 1st. And then that weekend after, I'll show a few other things. So anyways, please like, subscribe, and share if you want to. Um, leave the comments, including the words of the things you would like to be put in for. And yes, if I draw you with the using the word wool and I draw you again using the YouTube random comment picker I'm not playing favorites and your name comes up a second time with the word baby or hooks you can win twice or three times if you know you got some guardian angel on your side but anyways all right guys I'm gonna sign off upload this and We'll see what happens. Thanks, guys. Bye.